I'm Bianca Peters. It is Monday, May 21st. Let's get a check on that travel forecast from meteorologist Lisa Gonzalez. Thanks, Bianca. As we head into Tuesday for parts of Florida, we'll be dealing with some spotty showers and a few storms. And temperatures will be warming up upper 80s for Miami and Tampa, low 80s in Jacksonville and through Charleston. Up to the northeast, some heavy downpours possible in New York City, the high 67, Philly 71 and warmer in D.C. with 81, 68 in Boston. Upper 70s in Minneapolis and Fargo, 70 degrees in Chicago, nearly 90 in Kansas City, so certainly going to be hot. And along the West Coast, we'll see 66 in Los Angeles, 85 in Portland. Thank you, Lisa. Well, we know how hard it can be to work exercise and fitness into our daily lives. That's why every week on CBS 4 News, we're highlighting stories about what's moving you. This week, CBS 4 Chief Meteorologist Craig Setzer found that if you want to have fun while getting the ultimate workout, you might want to try Ultimate Frisbee. Hey, I'm Craig Setzer, and this isn't your typical game of Frisbee in the park. Thanks to our CBS4 Moving You campaign, I'm teaming up with Tim and Daniel and their team for a game of Ultimate Frisbee. By far the funnest and most exhausting game I've ever played. The game's been around for 50 years and draws men and women alike. I grew up playing soccer, and I found it to be pretty similar to soccer. It's called Ultimate Frisbee, and it's a mix of some skill, some coordination, and a lot of running. People who like to have fun, people who like to run, um, people who you know just want to have a good time because this group of people here, uh, it's a great community aspect as well as a great sport. It's fun to have a sport where we can really play together. So how do you play Ultimate Frisbee? It's not that hard if you like to run and you throw, you make the pass, and then you become the new person, and then you have 10 seconds, and you just try to catch a disc in the end zone to score. If you have the Frisbee, you're not allowed to run. Turnovers, unlike football, there's no stop and play. As soon as you someone drops a pass or someone gets a deflection, you gotta run back the other way and start hustling and playing defense. So it's a really tiring sport. So I took a stab at it, and here with Jim Barry's help are some of my highlights. Here's the fastest setzer. He's the guy in the blue shirt. Great hands with a flick of the wrist, a perfect pass. Here's Setzer now surveying the landscape. 1,001, 1,002. Here, you take it. The El Nino's on the move, and look at Setzer leap. I said leap, Craig, leap. Here's the long ultimate Frisbee pass to Setzer, wide open. Oh, how could he not hang on to that one? Eh, at least Craig didn't miss the high fives. Ultimate Frisbee moves us. What's moving you? Greg Setzer, CBS4. Well, thanks for watching. I'm Bianca Peters. A reminder, we're always on CBSMiami.com. Have a great day.